the 20th century is never old because it is constantly reborn. Making its first run in 1902, the 20th Century Limited was promoted as the most famous train in the world. And by the 1920s, it was one of the most profitable trains in the world. Its opulently outfitted cars carried passengers between New York City and Chicago, offering amenities that ranged from barbers to air conditioning and fine dining. Appetite-teasing delicacies top off the famous century dinner. Service was first rate a hallmark of the 20th Century Limited. But by the late 1930s, luxury alone wasn't enough to maintain ridership. So the New York Central Railroad commissioned Henry Dreyfus to modernize the 20th Century Limited. And oddly enough, America's most famous train is called 20th Century Limited. It streamlines into the news with a new model locomotive and a new record on its run from New York to Chicago. The streamlined model debuted in 1938 and quickly became the envy of the locomotive industry. Its lighter weight and greater engine power cut travel times between New York and Chicago to 16 hours. The redesign re-energized the 20th century's appeal, and it would serve travelers for another 30 years. But business steadily declined after World War II, as car ownership rose and airliners approached the jet age. The 20th Century Limited made its last run on December 3rd, 1967, ending a storied chapter in American transportation, a legend of the rails inspiring the travel of tomorrow. <laughs>